Hey, Richard Prin here. Welcome to my series of Logic Pro X tutorials. In this video, I'll be showing you how to change pitch of an audio file. So I have here a little audio file, a Halo drum loop. Yep, great stuff, but I want to change the pitch. How do I do that? So I select the file, which I have done, and then down here in the file window, I'm going to click on functions and open up the time and pitch machine. Here we go. So you'll see here you've got tempo and you've got pitch. Now we can deal with tempo another time, but pitch is my focus. So it says trans transpositions, that's moving the pitch up and down. Destination, you see here it says sense. That means that we are dealing in uh, multiples of 100. So if I wanted to change it up, maybe let's say one semitone, I would put 100 because that would be one semitone. And I would pre-listen. It's now moved up one semitone. If I want to move it up, a whole tone, it would be 200, because that's two semitones. Now, if I wanted to move it down, you put negative 100. So that's down one semitone. If I want to move it down 10 semitones, negative 1,000. Let's have a listen. Which I actually think sounds really cool. So I'm going to click Process and Paste. And there we go. So when I press play, and now obviously there is another way I could have done that. I could have gone back into my MIDI file, just moved this up and down and bounced in place again. But you know, if you don't have that option, it's good to use the time and pitch machine. So that's how you change pitch in Logic Pro X. Thanks guys. If you enjoyed this, please click subscribe and share.